What is the real role of technology? Is it saving money? Is it efficiency? Or, or is it something else? To me, the real value of technology and transformation is about data. There was this entrepreneur called Jim Barksdale. I don't know if you remember him from the 90s. He was one of the original founders of Netscape, the original web browser. He said something that I love. He said, if we have data, let's look at the data. If all we have are opinions, let's just go with mine. <laughs> you must have encountered situations where someone's got a really entrenched view. It's impossible to argue with them unless you've weaponized your position with data. But data isn't about being right. Data's ultimate tool is about changing the way people frame decisions to start with. I'll give an example. Uh, this is a friend and colleague of mine uh, called Andy Harris. He's one of the world's most successful TV producers. He's made a bunch of shows. I'm, I'm sure you've watched some of them. Uh, he made Wallander. He made Outlander. Uh, he made The Crown. Did any of you watch The Crown on Netflix? It's a good show, right? It almost didn't get made. Because if you think about it, big US TV networks don't get excited and wake up every morning and go, I really need to make a historical drama set in England. Right? They're expensive. You've got to find people who can do the accents. It's a nightmare. So they almost all, to, to a T, said no. So out of desperation, and I say desperation because this is quite a long time ago, he took the meeting at Netflix. And, I, and you know, Andy said he was going to this meeting thinking, why am I, this has come to this. I'm pitching a TV show to a website. Right? So he goes to the meeting, and uh, you know, there's Reed Hastings, the CEO of the company, uh, Ted Sarandos, head of content. And Andy walks in, and, and as soon as he walks in, he doesn't even get to say a word. Reed stands up and goes, Andy, we love the show. We'll take a whole season, maybe two. Andy said, don't, don't you want to hear the pitch? Don't, don't you want to make a pilot? And uh, Reed said, no, there's, there's no need. Uh, our algorithms have analyzed the show. We know it's going to be a big success. Uh, in fact, we can even tell you who you should cast. And when you come to scripting it, we'd really like our data engineers to sit down with your script writers because they've got a few pointers about what should happen when to maintain engagement for people that binge watch the entire season. This is crazy. You realize what's happened here. It's not that Netflix took television and put it on a streaming platform. It's that they took the data from a streaming platform and used it to reinvent the way they made decisions about making television. And ultimately, whatever organization you're in today, that's the question we have to be asking. How do we use data to de-risk the decisions that leaders need to make in order to make, increase the velocity of high-quality judgment?